the old trails are gone. It'll be hell finding a way out. Do you think a retreating army and their dominant will fare any better? Down there. So, Titan has knocked the fight out of our iron blood friends. Where are the rest of them? That can't be the main host. Wait. Our fortunes have turned, Sergeant. It's her. The dominant. Are you certain? The crystalline orthodox is a backwards faith for a backwards people. In the Iron Kingdom, they teach that dominance are unclean aberrations, born of blackest sin. Only their priests are allowed to perform the rites of priming. And I see many. We end this quickly. <sighs> Salvation now came, Alad Scully. Let this be the end. Avis, care to kill some iron blood? Gladly. Whiten, you focus on the target. Understood. She's not even fully primed! I will not have their blood on my hands! In for the kill! At last. Is she dead? I don't think so. Well, what are you waiting for? Bloody do it then. We 
Got company, Wyvern. with you, Wyvern! Now that that's done... I won't ask you again, Wyvern! Take her head so we can be done with this! I... I can't. I won't. You would betray the Holy Empire? Betray? I don't recall ever pledging allegiance to your Emperor. My service may have been bought with this brand, but not my loyalty. I just fight to survive. And you think I don't? The Empire will have our heads if we return empty handed. So if you won't take hers, I'll have to take yours. You're nothing. No one. And I will not fall by your hand! This way. Bloody wings. Well, come on then. Hugo dear, my proud desert lion. Would that you had taken care when chasing the hare? I expected more from the mighty Titan. You put the Ice Queen on her back, no doubt. But you'll have to work harder. If you're to claim this prize. My lady, 
the thunder. We'll be hearing more soon enough. You always were a fucking snake, Sid. Gather the men. We have work to do. Who's this fine hound I see before me? A fine hound who saved your life, that's who. Torgal. Aye? His name is Torgal. You two acquainted? Well then, you won't mind taking him off my hands. Funny. I'd always pictured you as more of the chocobo type. Clive Rosfield. Come now. Fleet as flame, fierce as a wildfire. That there was the blessing of the Phoenix. I'd heard rumors that you'd survived, but I never paid them much heed. Calm down. I didn't come all this way for your handsome mug. Now her, on the other hand, she seemed worth muddying my boots for. None the worse for wear. Still, might be best to get a second opinion. Back her up. <laughs> I mean it. Well, I'm not about to leave her here. Not one with a warm bed waiting. It's all right. You're welcome to join us. You do want to help her, don't you? Uh, uh, Sid, if we aren't back soon, none will have our heads. Explain everything once we're back at the hideaway. Come on. Much further now. But we're in the middle of the Deadlands. Keen eye, you. The blight sucked this place dry. Meaning no trees, no birds, and no magic. But it also means no neighbors. The last place anyone would think to look. Sweet home.
this place. These are fallen ruins. Well, we didn't think they'd mind. And it keeps the black from our lungs. But how do you survive without magic? How does anyone? Hard work and a bit of nelf. You must be starving. We grow them here, believe it or not. Hmm? Suit yourself. You're back. Ah, so are you. And this is the dominant. How cold since we found her. I was hoping you might give her a look over. All right. Goots, get her upstairs. Well, but Nan will... Don't fret about Karen. I've taken care of her feet. All of it. She's the best healer this side of the belt. You've nothing to worry about. Go on. Have a look around. I'll be in my solar. He's a soldier, lad. I'd be surprised if he wasn't. The smell of war is thick about him. If you can read, don't let Otto know. We'll put you to work on the ledgers too. No exposure. I'll be needing a new sword. He's a soldier, lad. Be surprised if he wasn't. The no smell of war is thick about him. Just working on a pet project of mine. Though she's not above biting the hand that feeds her. All right. I was hoping we might try and solve the mystery of poor Clive Rossfield. A bearer of the San Brequa Imperial Army sent behind enemy lines. With orders to wait until it turned into a brawl, then slit the Dominant's throat in the chaos. I didn't know it was her. How could it be? And so, to save her neck, you slit your sergeants, then set your sights on the hills, conveniently forgetting how the Empire deals with deserters. Because with that on your chop, my friend, we both know you won't be getting far. You've fallen a long way, Lord Rossfield. Have it said that I'm a poor host? What do you mean to do with her? Do with her? Why nothing? Her life is her own now. If I wanted to use her, do you think I'd be talking to you? All I want to do is help. Dominance like her, branded like you. Of course, the realm doesn't approve, which is why we live in a cave. And it's also why we need help. From Brandy who know one end of a sword from the other. What say you, Clive? Will you join us? Sid, was it? I trust that you'll do right by Jill. But until my brother is avenged, I must walk my own path. Avenged? My brother was murdered by a second dominant of fire. 
Phoenix is evil twin. Oh, bother me. Another rumor proven true. I only stand here today because of Joshua. Thirteen years I've waited for this chance. I've slept in filth, drunk from a gutter, killed more men than I can count. You're right. The Empire will not suffer a deserter. This will be my best opportunity. My last. Which is why you should join us. I told you I'm not interested, I know. One of my scouts sent word there's a group of branded fugitives north of here, in the Imperial village of Lost Wing. Among them is one he believes to be a dominant of fire. Is he certain? What say we go and ask him? This doesn't mean I'm joining you. Best mate ready then. You'll find everything you need down in the main hall. As well as a few things you don't. Have fun. The dominant needs her rest. Was it? Perhaps you can help. Sid asked me to make ready for our mission. How does one go about that here? Uh, well, uh, there's old Nan's place. Uh, oh, uh, on second thoughts, uh, you maybe want to see Blackthorn first. A blacksmith. To the forge it is then. Oh wait, no, hold up. You'll be needing this. Blackthorn won't take no notice of you otherwise. Might not anyway. Are you Blackthorn? What if I am? I'm no time for idle chatter. I'm not here to talk. I'll be accompanying Sid to Lost Wing and I need you to see to my equipment. You could be accompanying the goddess Grieger to our holy bedchamber for all I care. I'm not lifting a finger for you. Is that so? Do you want that or not? I can take it back. Oh, damn you, Coots. All right, all right. No need to be hasty. Let's have a look at you. <laughs> I doubt that lot could stay a Moogle's fart. Bloody Imperials. They'd rather see their bearers dead than then kid it out properly. I'll do what I can. As a favor to Goot's mine. The bell sees a square. You want anything else? You bring your own materials. I'll bear that in mind. Thank you. Mm. A word of advice don't let Sid decide what's best for you. I suppose I should thank Goots. The gift worked. You have my thanks. I, uh, uh, <laughs> Come on, nearly there. <laughs> you, blankets, quick as you like. Right. 
You making comfortable while the bed's made up? <laughs> well, you're just gonna stand there. Someone fetch some water. I'll get the bucket. You go and see if Otto needs out, eh? Yeah. Wait, me? What the hell have I got myself into? Who are they? Huh? They're freed Imperial bearers. Who the hell are you? <laughs> Shit, at this rate, you won't make it through the night. Think you can find your way up them stairs to the infirmary? We need Taya. Well, go on. Shift your ass. Was Tai the one looking after Jill? Your friend needs her rest. There'll be time for tearful reunions when she's recovered. I'm not here for Jill. You're wanted downstairs. There are injured bearers in need of attention. Well, why didn't you say so? <sighs> I did say so. <sighs> He's going to be all right. But I'll need to examine them both in the infirmary. My work's just begun. Another fine day at the hideaway. Too many of the bearers who come here arrive in this state. It's no easy thing, casting off your chains. By the time most pluck up the courage, they're already too far gone. These two here are the lucky ones. The name's Otto. You need anything? You ask me. Well, Otto, I do need some supplies. Do you now? Then Lady Karen over there will be more than happy to help you. Right. Oh, and thanks. Be seeing you. Not likely. I won't be staying. Is that right? Well, for as long as you are here, consider yourself welcome. You helped us today, and we won't forget it. I need supplies for my journey to Lost Wing. Otto said you could provide them. What's that? Just... <sighs> it's Clive. Well, Clive. I hear that dog is yours. Since he followed those supposed... I won't. So, what, Live? That's all. Why, you're barely a guilty, your neck. Taking his side now. And after all I've done for you. All right. All right, I can make an exception. But just this once, mind. My stores are getting cluttered and I need to make room for the next shipment. Thank you. Thank me. Thank your dog.
leaving already, are you? It's you I'll miss the most, Lady Karen. It always is. Don't stop you going, does it? This should be fun. Right. There's a good girl. Hungry, are you? flies everywhere. I told you we should have taken the Crystal Road. And I told you we're outlaws. Well, you want every bounty hunter in Storm harrying us from here to the Holy Capital? Besides, what's wrong with a shortcut through nature's splendor? God. The Deadlands claim more of the realm each day. But a place like this still exists is a miracle in itself. Blood flies and all. You'll be back in Imperial land soon. Are you alright? Never better. Sounds like it. <laughs> that there is a fine hound. Soon took to hunting. Fearless as you like. It's good to have you back, Torgo. Now. We don't want to be caught in the forest after nightfall. I suppose not. Did I mention there'd be deadly beasts? There'll be deadly beasts. Nothing to trick. 